According to the school superintendent, it began all really with the desire of parents to have armed SROs in the schools and a willingness by parents for their local tax dollars to pay for it. Now, there are five of them who will work under the direction of Elma police officer Joseph Del Plato, who served as the district's sole school resource officer for the past several years. They are all retirees from a variety of law enforcement agencies. State Senator Pat Gallivan has tried to get a bill passed in Albany for the state to fund school resource officers so local taxpayers won't have to without success. We still have a significant amount of people, especially from the New York City area, with an aversion first to police officers and an aversion to police officers with guns being in a school. Uh, and, and so many of them look upon it that the police officers there, or they say, police officers are to arrest kids and destroy lives. That isn't the case at all. These SROs, though, are technically not cops, rather licensed armed security guards working for a firm the district contracted with to supply them, which also makes hiring them more affordable. Gallivan's bill would also provide retired police officers serving as SROs with full peace officer powers, including the power of arrest, and raise the cap on what a retired cop can earn and still receive their pension, which he says would attract more of them to become. SROs. Well, Dave, we hear a lot about school resource officers being there to develop a rapport mm -hmm. with kids. Is mm -hmm. that what they see as their primary role? Well, while that is certainly something they hope to foster, Mary Alice, their primary role as they see it is to protect the school, its staff and its students. But establishing a good rapport, as you said, might help them gather intelligence if something were planned to go down and if students trust them enough to come forward with information. Mary Alice? Obviously a priority for parents and those citizens in the Eurocore district. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Dave.